Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Antimatter Chemistry. And last episode we made this magnificent beast, the um the mob factory. Mob farm. Whatever you want to call it. So that works pretty well. I have an ender tether there. I'm not sure if it I'm I'm using it correctly. Because Endermen still get out and they zip round, but they always come back here. So maybe I am using it correctly. But what I went and did in between episodes is make another Ender Portal. Ender Portal? No, because I'm going through the Ender Portal. I made another mob farm, but this time in the Nether. So it's the exact same principle. This time I followed the advice of... Nighty Panther, I think it was. If it wasn't you, then I'm sorry, but I'm pretty sure it was you. I put down the vector plates first, and then I put down the spikes, rather than the other way around. Um, it keeps collecting the 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 swords. I don't know how to filter out the swords, but never mind. But it's the same thing. I've got. The, although it, for some reason it seems to be brighter in here. I don't know why it's brighter, but it seems to be brighter in here. But, um, yeah, same thing. We got the Vacumulator. I was trying out a servo on this to see if I can get it to the work but I realize I've got to put like every durability of sword and that doesn't make sense so I'm going to take that servo off because I just went and um, cheated it in just to see I don't know I'm pr probably not using it I could probably use a basic servo but I don't know how to use it so in the meantime I've still got lots of swords coming in oh that was our first enderman oh wow but Everything else is the same. And we have... Yeah. In the nether. I don't even know where that landed. I'm guessing because it's close to Halloween. You would get something like a flash of lightning. And then a ghostly figure appearing. It doesn't do anything to you. But it's just... There. And that's really annoying. So oh yeah, so now we've got two mob farms, one in the nether, and we get super sparkly um, stuff. We're getting loads of loot boxes, which is cool. I don't know what's in these pink ones. Let's, oh no, I should leave one in there. No. Right. Let's have a look. Dimlet Parcel, Argon Light, and Obsidian Breaker. 32 Obsidian Breakers. Okay. I mean, it's not brilliant, but... There you go, that flash of lightning again. And it only seems to happen in the... In the end. I don't know what that is. But I'm guessing that's a Halloween thing. See what's in these. Yeah. Uh, 20 dimlet parcels, okay. What else? Was that it? That was it. Okay. Right, let's go on to what we were going to do this week our stuff back uh filter i had made a filter i can't remember how i made it um yeah iron nuggets glass a bit of paper and some iron so i made that but uh i like i said i'm probably not making it correctly i'm probably not using it correctly so there's that <laughs> i don't know I really don't know. Um, can we want to get rid of this sword? I probably should have found some lava just to put it in. Um, right, this week. 
what are we doing this week? We're going to make a scarab. Because last week, we, oh, between chapters, I made the fertilizer, which was really, really, really annoying and ground, grindy, but I did it. So we get, uh, what can we check? We've already got a, re should we get another reinforced satchel? Traveler's knapsack. I don't even know what that does. Two hardened upgrades. Traveler's goggles, which gives us night vision. Traveler's goggles gives us zoom, or Traveler's cloak, cloak gives us slow fall. Night vision or slow fall? I guess slow fall. That's a chest plate accessory. Alright, let's try that then. Alright, so we have... We've completed chapter two then. Yes, we have. Chapter three, we're almost finished. We need to make a scarab and then we need to create the at atom portal and enter. So this, uh, this did we do? Yes, we did. And we unlocked more recipes and got a little smiley face, really. Scarab. Okay, we get a bread for that. We need demon ingots, platinum ingot. Diamond, cobalt large plate, uh, platinum, chemical combiner, platinum from polish andesite. Do we have any andesite? Uh, andesite we can get combining cobblestone and diorite. Do we have any diorite? Or we can put silicon dioxide there. Okay, we have plenty of silicon dioxide. Is that some of it? Yes. Well, that's not plenty, but we do have plenty. It's that pukey color. Is that it? Yes. Get a stack of that. Chemical combiner. Unlock recipe uh, and a site. Now press A to lock it in. There you go. So we're getting that. Turn that into polished diorite. And then if we put that in the chemical dissolver, do we have enough? We don't have enough for a platinum ingot. Are you kidding me? Are there other ways that we can get platinum? Platinum, platinum, P A L T, platinum. Okay, so there's andesite, obviously, platinum ingot, platinum ore. Do we? I doubt we have any platinum ore. And everything else is going to be stuff from Atum, right? How many do we need to make a scarab? Just need the one. Alright, well then let's make some more polished diorite then. Uh, that's how we're going to do it right now. That in here. That protein? Yeah, that's protein. Right, let's put this in here. We need 16. I should really go mining in the deep dark again. I don't particularly want to, but we need to go 15, 16. Voila. Alright, chemical combiner. And we need. Platinum. If I click on that, click on that. Vita. Press A and that should put it in. Right. I'm sure we'll need it again. One platinum ingot. Good. Um, diamond. 
to do the diamond, we're supposed to, not diamond, demon ingot. There is some convoluted casting. Uh, da, 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 da. All right. Extra utility. Is that the only place we get it from? Was it in the book? Uh, demon ingots are obtained by throwing gold into a one by one lava pit with eight nether bricks surrounding the lava on all faces. What? Demon ingots are obtained by throwing a gold ingot into a one by one lava pit with eight nether bricks surrounding the lava on all faces. Okay. Um, we have nether bricks, right? Okay, so I think... Oh, hello, Enderman. Right, if we go out here... One, two, three, four, five... Right, if we take that out, take that one... Five. We still have three. Surrounding the lava on all faces. Right, do we have our bucket on us? Have I had a bucket of milk. What did I do with it? Right, let's that. Oh, traveller's cloak. Alright, um, Diamond chest plate. If we take that off, then we're not really protected. I'm not taking that off. Not right now. Um. Oh, you know what I did get? Halloween lollipop. It dropped from something. Let's eat it. Okay. Jump boost. For how long? Ten minutes. Okay. That's not bad. At least we didn't get anything bad from it. Because it did say, oh, you might need a bucket of milk. All right, let's take the other bucket. Let's take a... And what did it want? A gold ingot. Yes. Did I not make gold? Pretty sure I did. Maybe I didn't. That's Electrum. Want. Right, you can stay there, take out the gas tier. Now let's just empty this out very quickly. Andesite. Another brick. Argon lights. I'll do for now. Just wanted to make my inventory just a little less cluttered. Did I take? No, I didn't take the gold out. Alright. Right. Uh, try throwing a gold in and see what happens. Just one. Okay. That worked. That worked. Why did it say eight nether bricks? Because we didn't use eight. But hey, that works. I'm not knocking it. All right. Um, Scarab. Still looks like, a, it looks like a chicken wearing a tutu. A roast chicken wearing a tutu. Uh, two diamonds, one, and a cobalt large plate. 
Right, we should have some cobalt in here. And we need eight. The large plate. I just like bouncing. <laughs> I like being Tigger. Cobalt large plate. Large plate cast. Our cobalt. Let that smelt up. Let's just take these while we're waiting. Because you know, there's nothing wrong with a little bit of husbandry. Hopefully I have enough room in my inventory for all of this. And actually we don't need this anymore. We might as well just cut it down. Alright, let's hoover this all up. Yeah, the, the paper we'll always need. The, um, the cactus not so much although we didn't really get a lot of cactus in the first place and put the food in here so now what am I missing that right cobalt should be done it's doing I planned it like that. As you know, I plan everything perfectly. It just works. You know how it is. I'm just good like that. The large plate. Have a yes we do. Missing two diamonds. Uh, we don't have that many diamonds. Right, let's put that back in there. And we have a scarab. I have no idea what it does. But we have one. Do we get any? We get 32 bread. Okay, to create the portal, make a flat 5x5 five five layer of sandstone. Make a square ring of sandstone on top of the previous layer. Make two block tall pillars of sandstone on top of each corner of the ring. Fill the center with water and toss the scarab in the water. Okay, so we need sandstone. Do we have sand? We have 12. Not enough. What do we need to make sand? Although I'm guessing after this sand is not going to be a problem. Uh, chemical combiner. We need silicon dioxide. Yeah, because we're going to Atum, the land of the pharaohs or whatever it is. I'm pretty sure they're going to have a lot of sand. So, sand. Lock that in. Those in there. And let's start making. Do we have any other silicon dioxide? That. Did I open any of these? I think I did, didn't I? I can't remember. Uh, left click. Ooh! Energy upgrade, speedy hoppers, helium lights, we've got cake, silo, psyloc, silo, psybin, blaze rod, storage upgrade, speed upgrade, speed upgrades for what? I don't know. Another drop of evil, hardened upgrade kit, ender chest. Oh, nice. Okay. And we have. Stuff. 
Okay. Um. All right. Cake. Oh, we haven't eaten the cake yet. Let's put the cake on top of here. Uh, poppers. Okay. Energy upgrade for nuclear craft. Speed upgrade. Oh, speed upgrade for refined storage. All right, that's cool. 32 bread. Ender chest. I don't. Do we have. No, we don't have any other ender chests. Oh, we've got more than one cake. Oh, that's nice. And that in there. I should really put the other stuff in there. Okay, so we've eaten the cake. Alpha, drop of evil, vector, vector, copper. Helium light. Although we might, I. It was the sand we were waiting on. All of that, just for forty-eight sand. Yeah, I don't think twelve sandstone is enough for two sets of five by fives. One, two, three, four, five, three, four, five. Yeah, not quite enough. All right, so what I'm going to do then, I'm going to get some more silicon dioxide and I'm going to make some sandstone and then when I've got the altar ready I will be back with you guys so I will see you in a bit okay I'm back I've made it I barely had enough silicon dioxide but I believe this is it let's throw in the scarab no okay that didn't work all right, well, we've made made the ring. Oh, maybe, oh, 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 oh. That's a three by three. Maybe inside dimension has to be five by five. Okay, Um, that means then we need an extra Okay. Take you off. No. One. No. One, two, three. That will come here. All right, let's take that's one. Four. One, two, three, four. Oh, fooey. There you go. Three. All right. So that's one, five. And this should be one, three. I'm guessing. No. One, Three, four, five. You'll need an extra one. Right, let's take one out of the middle. I'm going to have to go back, make more sandstone. I need one, two. Oh, look, this looks one, two, four, five. One, 
fork. Yeah, that's short. So I need to go back and make some more. Oh, this is a... All right, cool. I will be back in a bit. Okay, so I am back. I don't know how many of you guys were yelling at the um at the at your computers, but I went if if you were watching before, I went and made a five by five ring underneath, and it should have been a five by five base because it did say a flat five by five, but that didn't quite register. So yes, um, I don't know what we need. Uh, okay, hold on. Let me empty out my inventory. I don't want to go in with a full inventory and then we get killed or something. Pick out all the stuff. Uh, the pickaxe we might need. Hatchet we might need. Bucket. Maybe I should bring a bucket of water. I don't know. Uh, the, uh, bring some other block. Leave that. Oh, yeah, I could do the shovel, the milk. Take the milk and the bow. Probably need the bow. Have I got any arrows? I should have arrows. But basically, it's literally to go. I have no arrows. Why? Why? Why do I have no arrows? I should have. Do I have arrows in the? And, uh, no. Why do I not have any arrows? Did I use them all? I might have done. Arrows. Alright. My arrows we need. We need feathers. We have feathers. We even have a couple of chickens. Okay. All right, we have a couple of arrows. Better than nothing. Definitely better than nothing. Let's let's just go into the portal, and then we can come back out again because that's all we need to do. Go in and back out. And Geronim, oh. Okay, I'm genuinely holding my breath here. What do we have? have sand strange sand and i'm seeing mobs spawning out there are they mobs or are they people i don't know might be people is that a village over in that direction uh let's pull her up a bit oh there's a mob spawner right there I have no idea what that is. It looks like there might be a village or something. I heard somebody. What are you? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you good? Are you bad? I can't read the tooltip from this distance. What are you? Barbarian. Okay. That doesn't sound good. Barbarians. Are you going to... Are you going to try and kill me? Yes, you are. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. All right. Back in. Yeah, they're going to try and kill us. We need to make better armor. We need to do stuff, but we're in. We are in. And we get chicken sandwich, stone torch, Anubis mercy. What does that do? Soul pact. When you die, you keep your equipment and your active items. But you can only use it three times. Okay. Okay, 
Um. All right, so we are now going getting into unexplored territory. All right, so we need to make better armor. That's the first thing we need to do. All right, so we've completed chapter three, chapter four. Kill two pharaohs. Occasionally, at tomb, you will find pyramids. At the bottom of them, there will be a sarcophagus. To fight the pharaoh inside, place a lit royal torch on four corners round the sarcophagus, then right-click to instigate the fight. Be warned, this boss is very strong. Unmodified steel armor and an unmodified blade are not sufficient. Okay, so we need to unmodified steel armor. I I don't know. Buy the chapter four DLC for twenty coins. We got DLC. All right, so we are going to have to look at. Um, we've got the armor thing. Um, Tinker's armory construct thing. Um, where is it? Armor station. So we need to look and see what's the best armor that we can make. Was there a armory book? Oh, more. Uh, was there a manual? Um. Boron, steel, electron, silver. I don't know what's the best thing. There must have been a manual. But it's probably in a chest somewhere. But I will have to research that in between episodes. And then, and then in the next episode, we are going to go and investigate At Atum. And see what's going on. Because we have raiders. We have pharaohs, which we need big armor, the food book. And we have all manner of strange things that are probably going to want to kill us. And to be honest, I don't really want to die. So that's going to be any manuals in here? No, there should be a tinker's manual somewhere. I'll have to have a look through. So anyway. We've gone, we've finished chapter three and we've gone to Atum. And now we need to, we need to fight our way around Atum. So thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to, um, to grow my channel. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.